With the COVID pandemic more than two years old, some folks have now gotten the virus more than once now. Data shows reinfections are most commonly from the BA5 subvariant. The CDC saying that BA5 makes up 90% of new COVID infections across the country. In fact, WCNC Charlotte's Chloe Leshner explains why. Since the pandemic started, there have been several different strains of COVID. Alpha, Delta, Omicron, and now its subvariant, BA5, all bringing new challenges. Viruses are very smart. Like, you know, viruses have this tendency to, um, like, you know, if they are actively uh, infecting a large swath of our population, you know, there is active mutations that keep on ha happening in these viruses. Once you're infected, your immune system will recognize the virus and be able to fight it off. While mutations are to be expected, COVID has changed so much the body doesn't always recognize newer strains, even if your immune system would recognize an older strain. The spike protein on the latest variant, BA5, is so different than the original Omicron strain. People who were infected just a few months ago can catch it again. And even though the Omicron-specific boosters are not available yet, staying up to date on shots can help in a case of reinfection. When it comes to vaccination, it's not just a matter of, of infection. It is a matter of severity of infection, right? And that's something that has been shown time and time again through these variants, that if you're vaccinated and boosted appropriately, the risk of severe infection goes down pretty significantly. Doctors say there's no telling how many times someone can get COVID and stress the importance of staying protected. Chloe Leshner, WCNC Charlotte.